there is a lot of content about how to write and properly phrase prompts for generative AI. In my opinion, most of it is BS. The way that the prompt is written doesn't matter relative to the quality of the context and data provided. I'll show you. In this video, I'm going to feed ChatGPT a bunch of crappy prompts while adding more and more targeted data to get a really, really good prospecting email. You'll see that the more contextual data provided, the better the email gets. All right, let's say I just got a Slack notification that a new lead just came in. Let's use AI to write a follow-up prospecting email. We'll paste in the basic information about the company and contact that we got. Okay, not bad, but the email is pretty broad and not personalized. Let's open this lead's Zoom Info contact profile and see if we could get more context. Okay, boom. We can see he just started this job. Also, we used trackers to identify him as a customer champion at a previous company. Let's add that to the prompts. Wow, right away we can see this email is a lot more personalized and also talks to his previous use. Now let's look at some of the initiatives going on at this company. Okay, this is interesting. I can see they just acquired a company. They are hiring sales roles, looking to expand into global markets like EMEA and APAC, and are also experiencing challenges related to outbound lead gen and are allocating budget to display advertising. Let's paste this in there. Okay, that is much better. The AI now suggested products that could support each of the company's key initiatives. Note, there are plenty of other data types and real-time signals that we can use to further personalize this and make it even more relevant, like intent, website pages visited, technographic data, and a bunch more. But let's leverage this information that we already provided to multi-thread this account. From this org chart section, we can grab the contact info of key stakeholders so we can use GPT to draft an email to them. Boom, that looks great. To recap, with a few pieces of relevant information, we turned a generic email into something someone is likely to respond to. Then, GPT was able to leverage the data we put into it on the target company to draft relevant personalized emails to several members of their buying committee. I want to note that of course it helps to provide GPT with continuous feedback to improve responses, but that part isn't rocket science. But the underlying point is clear, that the accuracy and completeness of the contextual data provided is what will have the greatest impact on your results.